Darren from the M6P here in wonderful, beautiful Huber Heights, Ohio, uh, the theater here to see Ant-Man and the Wasp, Quantumania. I'm not sure how I feel about this one going into it right offhand. Um, the place is pretty packed in beautiful Huber Heights, Ohio. Um, so uh, we have an M6 pier, uh, uh, actually two M6 piers who will be viewing this film uh, with me. I'm really excited. Um, one of them should be up the way just here. We'll see who. Stay tuned. Oh, wow. What else is out or coming out? All right, John Wick, Adam Driver fighting dinosaurs, the uh, Oppenheimer nuclear bomb stuff. All right, nothing. All right, here we go. There's an M6 pier here somewhere. I can just feel it. Oh, wait. That might be him. Thank you. Hey, what's up, man? Hey, what's going on? <laughs> I told you. Oh, <laughs> All right. up on me. Alrighty, we'll put the cameras down until the uh, show. Alrighty. It's grand. We have uh, the third M6 pier here. And let's go. Okay, so we've sat down and look at this crowd. We're only 15 minutes away from start time. And look at this crowd for Ant-Man. <laughs> they read the reviews, what can I say? Oh my goodness. Uh, so I just had to take a step out. Uh, the first trailer is the Flash trailer. Lots of somebody had a mess here. So if anybody's wondering, a bottle of water at a movie theater in Huber Heights, Ohio costs $5.27, but I was thirsty. February 24th. That's a wrap on this oh. You gotta hold it in. Alrighty. Which one? Oh, oh there it goes. <laughs> ah. Okay, wow. Uh, oh. Quantum Mania. Yeah, we just, well, we just wrapped it up <laughs> uh, and saw the uh, mid credit scene. I'm not really sure what to think yet about that one. Uh, Tim mentioned we're going to have to watch it a few more times to get out of here. Oh, go ahead. Okay. This one's just... Yeah, I'm going to need a few days probably to process. Um, I, I don't know. I don't know exactly what to think about it exactly. Um, it didn't reach out and grab me as like, wow, this is my favorite. Yeah. Uh, but it also, it also didn't leave me in the pit of despair like Eternals. I'm, I'm leaning slightly more positive than negative, but not like not like overwhelmingly. Yeah. Um, you know, I, I think there were a few major bravos. I think John, Jonathan Majors was fantastic. Um, I, I think Michelle Pfeiffer did very well yeah. as well. Um, I, I think that there were a, a few things in the storyline. I was I was concerned originally that having both Modoc and Kang would make the story a little too busy. It really didn't. Um, so I think that kind of, that balance was actually there. But if I had to, if I had to do it, I'd say, you know, probably a six, six, maybe six and a half. Yeah, that's probably where I was going to place it at. Again, but again, I'm going to have to watch it a few more times. Uh, like many of the same things, uh, got to hear Darren's name a lot in this one. That was weird. Uh, that's one dog, by the way, spoiler alert. Um, thought Jonathan Majors did a great job. Um, that mid credit scene was interesting to see where this all goes. Um, Tied in some of the comic stuff. Again, just so much. All these Marvel movies, just so much wacky stuff. And then, of course, the kids, Cassie Lang, and mm -hmm. another plot device. But overall, yeah, I'll give it a six. Uh, I'm going to watch it a few more times, and hopefully, uh, maybe that score goes up a little bit. So. Yeah, Quantum Realm itself was just kind of a weird universe. I think that's probably what caused a lot of the initial bad reviews, and yeah. it's why leaving the movie, we're kind of like, what in the world did we just watch? <laughs> but at the same time, um, at the same time, there were some things that were good, and the, the storyline itself wasn't terrible. Um, you know, was I blown away? No. Um, but was it uh, was it something that I would probably watch again? Yeah. So, you know, like I said, slightly more positive than negative, but not blown away. Oh, and the Marvel MCU new phases continue. <laughs> Very lackluster. I believe this one kicked off phase five, right? So this is, yeah. this is this is the kickoff for phase five. So not a not an awful start. Room to grow, let's put it that way. Uh, and until next time, make yours M6P.